Hi guys and welcome to Kimvember Day 12. Let's go to the Kimvember calendar to see what it is that we are going to be doing today. Alright guys, so for Kimvember Day 12, we are going to be doing a facial. We're going to be getting a facial. I was supposed to get lashes also, but I'm not going to bother with the lashes. Um, we can experiment another time where that is concerned but for the facial I am going to be getting a facial but I'm going to be doing it myself because the place that I was supposed to go to they don't have any openings so I will just give myself a nice little facial a nice little at home facial and yeah it's gonna be it's gonna be good it's gonna be fun Alright guys, so we are going to be doing our little DIY facial now. So the first thing that I'm going to be doing is cleansing my face using this Neutrogena Cream Cleanser. I like using this cleanser because a little goes a long way. Well, I'm sure I wet, wet up my face first. No, I'm not going to bother with that because it ain't that serious, right? Right? It will. Oh boy. After this night, I'm going to wet up my face first. It's not what I think. Okay. It's a little moisture. I get the product activated. So I literally just use a dime size amount. And now I'm just going to wash my face, basically. I like using this um, cream cleanser also because it is it's easy to work into the skin you know it it's really nice and it has no i'm not sure it has yeah it has salicy salicylic acid wow so it will help with acne because i have this little bump here and it's not going anywhere which is weird so i'm just gonna work this into the face Normally, I wash my face in the shower. So this is how I do it. Nice. It's, it's just so easy to work into the skin. I love it. Okay. So now that that is done with, I am going to see if I can do a little bit of derma planning. It's my first time doing that, but I feel like I really want to. I just want to try it this time around. I mean, it's a facial. I'm going to take some aloe vera gel and put that onto my skin and then shave my skin using the gel all right let's let's start with one section at a time okay. oh you know I, oh i'll call me this 98 percent aloe vera this is burning me i got these razors from i think it was walgreens face razor so I'm gonna be trying this I'm a little bit nervous because this is burning me so let's see I don't really want to get rid of my sideburns because I like them Damn. Mm -hmm. oh my gosh
bear. I'm gonna wash this off. That was a fun experience. I mean, my skin even looks brighter than normal. This was so cool. So far, I'm loving everything. This technique definitely will have to incorporate it in my monthly skincare routine. Look at the I don't know, you probably guys yeah, probably not even gonna be seeing it, but I look so much clearer. And look at all the hair that came off. Which part is that? I don't even want to see this. It looks disgusting. Yeah, but would highly recommend you guys do this. Right, so the next thing is to exfoliate the skin. I'm going to be using this turmeric scrub and mask from Honey Vera. I'm guessing this is a Jamaican brand, I'm sure, yeah product of Jamaica I've had this for a very long time okay it was supposed to be a little bit more yellow than this I don't know if it expire I've never used it before there's no expiration date on it but you know we are going to be scrubbing with the turmeric scrub and mask because I wanted like a little brightening of my skin even though just shaving alone seems to have brightened my skin a lot a whole lot if it's a scrub am I not supposed to be scrubbing it in? I don't think so this is gonna be so hard to wipe off should I have should I have moistened my skin? Oh, I should have. Wet face and apply scrub or mask and massage gently. Leave on for 5 to 15 minutes and rinse thoroughly. I mean, I said to myself, oh, this are going so tough. It has a lot of clay in it so that's why it's giving stiff so I'm gonna wash this off and then move on to the next step all right guys so I'm about to steam my face now I'm actually going to be using a steamer a regular steamer for like clothes or so and you know I think I can use it as long as it's not too hot so I'm gonna be steaming my face for like 15 minutes and then ooh, we go on to the next step Face. One, um, 
I don't know if this is a cup or what, but one cup full is like 15 minutes, which is all you need. So the next step would have been to do some extractions, but I'm not going to do that right now because I don't have my tool. I don't know where it is. So I'm just going to clean my face. And I must say my face is feeling really good so far. I'm just feeling really good. I'm going to be doing a mask again. But this is a different mask. Yeah, this mask. This is a face mask from Kala. I got this at Fontana Pharmacy also. It is a collagen mask. So they said um, to put it on your skin and leave it on it for 5, 15 to 20 minutes and then take it off. So let's see. Let's uh, see what it's giving. No, it's here, it's not about. I'm not seeing oh okay it's nice and juicy see that tear already but I knew it would tear it's just so soft okay where's the face put it on your face like this like Because I just did something hot. This feels really good. Oh. Alright, so I'm gonna leave this on for 20 minutes and then I'll come back and peel it off. Alright, guys, so I think I think I'm done. So they said to peel it off. Oh, I am in love with how my face feels. So right now, I'm going to be using my jade roller to kind of, it's brand new. Give me a moment. You know from the ladies? It was in the freezer, so it's still cool. I'm gonna use this to like massage my face. Oh, <laughs> mm. uh, singular upward strikes to it. Oh, it feels so good. Oh. that because I don't I don't like this serum at all so I'm just gonna massage this into the face oh that's a lot Moisturize, we are going to be using some ponds moisturizer. 
this from what even skin tone so we're gonna go in with just a little bit because with this and it's supposed to have long way Skin feels so firm. Mm. I don't know a lot of facial exercises, but I think anything that will like pull the skin up is good and out. I guess is good. I don't know a lot. So. And what I also see people do is like use their knuckles. So now I'm trying to massage my face. I'm not even going to lie, I enjoyed this experience. feels so good so for me i am ending this experience with some vaseline lip therapy i'm going to be putting that on my lips and then um just leaving them on overnight so that tomorrow you know they will be nice and juicy i am experiencing a little bit of dry lips so i have to sleep with this at night but yeah this is what my face is looking like it looks so much brighter it it just looks so good i would recommend anybody if you don't have the time to do a facial or if you didn't book on time like me try and do a facial at home like you can do it you can do it and you know you will save a little bit of money i'm feeling really good I'm feeling really refreshed, really relaxed, and I just want to go to sleep. <laughs> go to sleep and see what my skin looks like tomorrow morning. I do have some trouble spots, which black person does not have any trouble spots. But, I mean, with consistency, I'm sure I can, you know, work on those and get rid of those. My biggest pet peeve right now is this bump right here like I don't know where she came from and she just she won't leave she won't leave but I love the way my skin feels I am in love so anyways you guys thank you so much for hanging out with me if you enjoy the content don't forget to give the video a big thumbs up it helps me out a lot sharing is caring so if you enjoy this content don't forget to share it with your friends or family who you think might enjoy it or find the information useful and also don't forget to subscribe if you have not subscribed already you see me in my nice robe and everything we're feeling so good thanks again for watching and i will see you guys tomorrow for kim fembo day 13. bye